Lady Catherine explained that Redham had escaped before we took the Abbey. She cried over the vile things that he had said to her as he held her captive, the vile way that he looked at her. Longarm told us about his castle, sheltered in the middle of the country. So far, he said, it had stood against every attack. Aside from the royal palace, he told us, it was the strongest castle in the land. The wolf, it was rumoured, had taken over that same royal palace, rebuilt it in his own ways. We were to head for Long Arms Castle and establish a way to take back the south from the wolf. We were, we knew, getting stronger. We couldn't back down now. They failed. Everybody fails me. The jackal said that they should die. I forbade it. I had a better plan. I told him to take the pigs and their forces and assault this new army now, to destroy it, to wipe it from the face of the earth. Longarm's castle wasn't impenetrable. There was a back door. And if the pigs could breach that and drop the drawbridge, the jackal's army could get inside, kill them all. The only condition I told him was the boy. I wanted him alive. He told me that I was being weak, that I was being influenced by my personal feelings, that I should let them kill him and be done with it. I was in charge. This was my war, and I would end it my way.